Have you ever thought about the lyrics to the song? It must have been love, but it's over now. You haven't? Let's break it down. Welcome back to Mishmash, the program where we dig deeper into the meaning of our favorite songs. In this episode, we're taking a look at a song written by Per Gisle and performed by the Swedish pop duo Roxette, which he was a part of with Maria Fredriksson, who sadly passed away recently. It Must Have Been Love was the duo's third number one hit and was their best-selling single thanks to it appearing in the movie Pretty Woman, starring Richard Gere and Julia Roberts. It must have been The original song was released in December 1987 and was written as a Christmas song under the title It Must Have Been Love, Christmas for the Broken Hearted. It featured a Jingle Bells kind of intro and the lyrics It's a Cold Christmas Day were later changed to It's a Hard Winter's Day when they recorded it for the movie Pretty Woman. And it's a hard Christmas day, a dream away. It's been the soundtrack of many heartbreaks, but what is it about? Glad you asked. It Must Have Been Love has two verses, two pre-chorus bridges, and a chorus that's repeated throughout this great tune. The song starts with the singer telling us, it must have been love, but it's over now. The lyrics are written in such a poetic way that already from the first verse, we're sucked into this heartbreaking atmosphere. Leave the winter on the ground. I wake up lonely, a stare of silence. In the bedroom and all around, all around. Wow, what a great poetic way to use lyrics, emphasizing the sad feeling caused by a broken heart. Our main character is reflecting over a past relationship that once was good, but now has ended. She's regretting the fact that she somehow lost her love and now is feeling lonely. The majority of people can relate to those feelings, including myself. Touch me now, I close my eye. We get an insight in how much she actually misses her ex-partner. It must have been love. But I lost it somehow. In the first part of the verse, she tells us in a way that it's her fault she lost what she misses, emphasizing that what they had was really good and now she regrets not having fought more for it to survive. From the moment we touched till the time had ran out. Wow, from the moment they touched till the moment their relationship ended. It was love. I love the sentence from the moment we touched till the time had ran out. It's actually one of my philosophies. Everything, even life, even love has a start and an end. Remember that when you're faced with hard times, even if you're faced with good times, it will start somewhere and it will end somewhere. Make believe in we're together. In the first part of the second verse, she's still in a fantasy or in a dream world, imagining that they're still together, telling us that she felt safe with him and that he had a good heart. Love should feel safe. But in and outside, I turn to water. Wow, this is so well written, telling us how her whole body reacts to her longing for his love. She's crying and like a teardrop, she melts into his palm. What? Now that's love. And it's a hard winter's day. I dream away. This is the sentence they changed for the movie, making the song go from a Christmas tune to one of the most popular love songs of our time. She's telling us that it's hard being lonely, especially in the dark winter, and that thinking of her past relationship somehow comforts her. The chorus is then repeated throughout the song. It's where the water flows. It's where the wind blows. 
Let's sum it up. Although Rock says it must have been love uses some very heavy metaphors, its meaning is actually quite simple. The title is based on the singer reflecting on a good romance that now has come to an end. The song can be interpreted in two ways. One is her reflecting on what went wrong in the relationship or as if she's more or less regretting the fact that it has come to an end. I think it's a great song in any way you look at it. Fun fact, in 1996, Rock said released an album with their greatest hits in Spanish. Oh yes, they were singing in Spanish. It Must Have Been Love was also featured on that album under the title No Se Si Es Amor, which translates to I Don't Know If It's Love. The chorus goes something like No Se Si Es Amor, Pero Lo Parece, Con El Soy Feliz, Pero Vivo Sin El, which translates to I Don't Know If It's Love, But It Looks Like It, With Him I'm Happy Even Though I'm Living Without. No Se Si Es Amor, Pero lo parece. I love this tune and I've always been a big fan of Roxette. Maria Fredriksen, thank you for being such a big part of my life soundtrack. I hope you are happy wherever you are and resting in peace. I hope you've gotten a new insight to this great tune. If you have any suggestions for a song you want to dig deeper look at, please comment, like, share, subscribe for more Mishmash. See you next time. And remember, when life gives you lemons, Make orange juice. <laughs> no si si es amor. <laughs> well, yeah, guys. I love this.